Oh, new gridiron rewards. Wait, did I actually get a reward? I oh my god, it's like the lag is real here. Um, where is it? Where is it? You have unlocked a mud pack. What? Where is this pack? I guys, obviously we are back with another pack opening. Oh, what is this? Mutt reward sub zero pack. Huh. Interesting. I should have 41 packs though, shouldn't I? Here we go. Enjoy this pack. I'll take it. Ooh, a frozen badge. We'll throw that in. We won't throw that in. I lied. But man, we have a lot of packs, guys, and I freaking can't wait to open them. I want to just check a few things real quick. Man, I am so far behind. Is there what's 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 going on here? One pole Arctic rush pack. I don't know what the hell that does. One pole Arctic rush pack? A one pole? What the fuck is a one pole? What? I have no clue what the hell that means. Like at all. <laughs> but let's get this badge thingy. Um icy thingy. I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing this. Should I even, like, be putting those badges in there? Should I be saving those badges for something else? Let me know, guys, because I have no clue. I'm not really in tuned with this whole situation. But we do have packs. And I don't know why, but I'm getting some lag here. Let's open this icy pack first. Let's just knock this bitch out. Of course, it's nothing as usual. I got the same... Really? Why am I having some lag right now? Like, I'm not I'm not a fan, okay? I'm not a fan. Um, but as you can see, these are the packs. We have some pretty decent packs. Let's start it off with these silvers. Let's get these bad boys out. And I literally mean bad boys. Like, they're not good. No golds. So, I like to just throw those in every once in a while. Just to see if maybe, just maybe one of these times, we'll, we'll get one of those lucky days. Speaking of lucky days, is today our lucky day? Are we going to be able to get, please, at least a quarter million? Come on. Like, at least a quarter. I'm not seeing it yet. No gold. There we go. Gold. Even though it's filled with bronzes. I believe we're almost done with five badges already. Um, the three badge, actually, I think was one of my best back in the day. Gold. Okay, honestly, I haven't seen what it looks like to pull a legit elite badge. Because usually I just run through these because, you know, I don't really get anything. <laughs> uh, so those badges were bad. That's 30 badges down the drain. Nothing good. I'm going to open that Sub-Zero pack, I think, third to last. Let's open one more gold. Elite. Fuck. I don't even seen a Josh Hill. Uh, what else do we have? Uh, let's just start ripping these three badgers. Come on, something decent. Pop me a bunch of silver. I guess bronzes and silvers right now are going for about the same anyways. Yay. You better give me some fire soon, man. I'm looking at some really shitty packs, okay? Okay, in three more packs, if I don't have at least... Something to feel good about. I'm gonna fucking back out. This is some gross. Okay, this is some some nasty booty cakes. Like what what is this? What is this? Ain't nobody wanna eat no nasty booty cakes for dinner. Okay, this is just for, for gross. Okay, we're gonna back out. But yeah, in case you didn't know, the two new legends did come out today, Reggie White and Anthony Nunez. I'm assuming I honestly would normally say that Reggie White would be um, the guy that you would create, but because he's such a high overall, I feel like he's the guy you pull, sadly, which I don't see why, considering, uh, well, I guess, I don't know, I don't know, man, whatever it is, I hope we pull the 24-hour the legend, or whatever, oh, there we go, oh, there we go. Let's continue opening these. These are fucking killing me right here. I'm loving it. Come on. I can't really complain. Last 10 Badger, I believe. Pack opening seems to be going a lot quicker this week than normal. Man, I'm still really not... I'm not feeling it, man. Those those two elites, you know, they really helped. But still, they're not, not really... 
we need to start picking up some more golds or some more elites because this is just bad. This week is just bad. So we better hopefully pick up something from one of these like packs. Um, I know we get an automatic elite badge from the X Factor, but hopefully we get like a legit elite pull like besides the elite exchanges. Oh, I almost just opened the elite exchange. Speaking of, I did not want to do that. Okay, so let's just open in accordance to, I wouldn't say rarity, but like value. There we go. Okay, I don't know what his value is, but decent card. So maybe at least 5k, hopefully. Nothing, and the last card is, oh, I thought it was elite for a second. I don't know why. I don't know why my brain told me that was elite for a second, but it clearly wasn't. I actually might run out of space, which is very rare for me. Oh, no. Well, I don't know what that is worth. Holy shit, a bunch of silver 70s. Cody Parkey, not, not bad. Um, Can't be too bad. Um, It's better than not pulling it, I'll tell you that. But obviously, I was looking for something that I know for a fact is valuable. I don't know what that's worth. Maybe I just pulled 100k. I don't fucking know. Red. Fuck. Oh, my accident backed out. Shit. Whatever. Pro pack. Come on. Pro pack last week was really freaking good for us. And it looks like this week it's not going to be the same unless that Patriots collectible is good. I actually want to, just because our luck hasn't even been that great anyways, I want to back out and check out uh, how much that Patriots thing goes for. I looked at one of them and like, it was like 10k for like a Packers one or something. It wasn't good, so I highly doubt that's gonna be worth anything. Yeah, it's already looking like it's terrible. Six thousand. But hey, at least I pulled something from the promo. Like shit, six packs left, but they are really good packs. Um, the X Factor is like, I don't even know, like 150, 200k if you were to buy one with coins. Silver badge. Bills. I wonder if you're automatically guaranteed that. Uh, Marcus Gilchrist. And just not anything good. Um, because I believe the... I'm going to open one of these. I'm going to open this journey. I'm closing my eyes. It's an automatic elite. So I'm just going to make sure I opened it. Uh, I feel like it's going to be someone 88. 88 on the nose. Jarius Bird, of course. Why wouldn't it be a scrub? Man, these packs have not been good for me. Legends pack. Can we pull one of the new legends? Whatever one it is. Uh, okay, Rondé Barber is a pretty damn good player. So that wouldn't surprise me if that was worth a little something, right? Terrible pack. Unless that Rondé Barber collectible is worth a lot. Let's open this Elite Exchange. Closing my eyes. Uh, I don't feel like it was good again. 87. 86 Zach Miller. What set did he go to? I don't remember. Week 10. At least it was a team of the week. Like, Jesus Christ. I don't know what this is. It's probably going to be pretty decent, but... Sub-Zero pack. What the hell? A lot of golds, man. Ooh, Gillum. Gilliam. Well, I mean, I don't know if these are supposed to be good. Oh, I didn't even realize it was a, a out of position player. Um, Steve Smith, not really a good one. I would have loved to have like I don't even care if it's gold or not. I just want that would have been really cool to have a uh, what's that dude's name? Sue. I would have loved a kicker Sue. This pack opening's not great, guys. I think we're down to the last pack. <sighs> Please, something legit elite. Well, I mean, that automatically comes with the pack. Oh, okay. I mean, could have been worse. At least it's an elite. Uh, I'm not going to get one of these packs ever again. Oh, my God. Um, so, yeah, kind of a bomb pack opening i think next week we're gonna open them on friday i just had a lot of good luck on saturdays like in succession like week after week after week 
So I was like, you know what? Let's just open them on Saturday again. Fuck it. Like, why not? I mean, that's the week that's been doing good for us. But this week was without a doubt like the worst. So we have 124 badges. I'm guessing under 10 golds. Yeah, seven freaking golds. Wow. We got boned this week, man. I've never had under like 15, but seven golds. Um, let's see what that Zach Miller is worth. Oh, yeah, the – what is that called? The Ronde as well. Wow. Wow. I mean, I'm still going to do like one elite exchange per week, I think. I know this ain't going to be worth much. Um, I'm still probably going to do one elite exchange per week just because you never know. And then it doesn't really go for too much. It's like kind of doing a large quick sell, to be honest. At least for my luck, it's better than a large quick sell. At least I'm coming back with a little bit. Um, but, Ronde Barber, please be like 50K, man. Uh, terrible pack opening. Like, what about Steve Smith? He's got to, These guys got to be dropping, right? They're really still that expensive. I don't really care for that Steve Smith too much, so... What I'm probably going to do is sell this guy and then maybe go for somebody that I'd rather have. Because, you know, it is it is kind of fun. Like, it's not just, like, not in tradition to have an out-of-position player, but it is kind of fun, like, having a cool player. Like, Tavon Austin, that's a hell of a cool card. Um, also, what's it called? A, uh, a Sioux Kicker. Like, I feel like I have to have one of those. Like, it's expensive, but I have to. I literally have to. Like, it's not even a bad player. Tom Brady would be cool, but it's not necessary. But, uh, what do we get? Damn, man. Fuck, this pack opening was not great. Last week's was amazing. Like, we got good freaking badges and everything, and we got a freaking good collectible. What do you mean, my auction sold? I don't even remember putting anything up. Oh, uh, yeah, I just, I, I kind of just put a Steve Smith up, didn't I? But uh, anyways, that's going to be the pack opening, guys. Oh, I should actually show you guys the team so you guys can decide what we should upgrade. As, of course, this video is going to come up right away. So I'm not even going to be close to even selling everything by the time uh, you guys see this. I'm thinking about getting uh, Captain Kels to start at tight end, but I don't know, we'll see. I should probably get a lineman, maybe a right tackle or a right guard. But I don't know, we'll see with that too. Uh... I don't really see too much we can really offensively upgrade. Defensively, however, right end, corner. Our strong safety is a little outdated. But honestly, our, our team's actually pretty good. Like, we're actually kind of getting to the point where we almost have every position 90 base, which means that we're going to have to start, like, actually saving up full time to, like, start picking up some of those extra tier players. Like, I'm not saying J.J. Watt is one of those guys, but kind of like a guy like J.J. Watt. Um, you know, that just that extra coinage. Like, yeah, you can get a nice 80,000, 90 overall player, but we got to get that extra, that extra coinage. Like, instead of having a Quinn, we could have a Steve Atwater, even though I will never get rid of Quinn because I feel like he's the best free safety in the game. Um, McManus is a hell of a player, but wouldn't that be amazing if we had Sue as our kicker? Because he could do it. Sue could do it, man, but... I don't know. I don't know. What do you guys think we should do? Um, there's not too many upgrades other than, you know, like I said, going for those extra tier elites. Like, yeah, Freeman's a 91, but we could go for like a Walter Payton or something who's like twice the coin, but, you know, barely more skilled. Kind of. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I'm just talking stupid now. But yeah, that was not a great pack opening. But I think it makes uh, what makes up for it is I had an insane draft on Draft Champions. I believe it's going to be 55. So by the time next week hits, you'll be able to see it. It's freaking crazy. But yeah, if uh, you're new to the channel, hit like and subscribe. I do at least one per week for pack openings. I try my best. Um, I do kind of don't have as many rewards left over from solo challenges as as you can see that, fa that X pa factor pack. Not going to be able to get one of those again unless they do. I did not want to record that. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so uh, hopefully I see you guys next video. But until next video. See ya.